everyone, welcome back to Cuddy's Bookshelf. So today is my first ever fairy loot unboxing. So I am very excited because I was on this waiting list for quite some time and then I went for a period broke and then <laughs> um, I went back on the waiting list and now I finally have one. Yay! So as always, all I've done is cut the tape and I will give you, oh my goodness. Oh, what a great first glimpse you've got. I'm just trying to pull some out without. Okay, there's your first glimpse. <laughs> so, I will just grab and go. So the first thing comes in this little Pirate King tea strainer designed by Belanca Design. Ooh, love that. So it is a nautical themed tea strainer. So obviously, oh, <laughs> I drink a lot of tea. It says on it, um, it is a bold and stupid move. I like it. Me too. So yeah, that is lovely. And I can bet you any money, my husband will also get some use out of that. So grab and go, grab and go. So it comes in this bag and it says, wave goodbye to makeup, reusable face pads. <gasps> I needed some of these. Thank you, Fairy Loot. So, you probably all know what face pads look like. What do they have on them? Oh, I like that. So they all have the same design on it, which is obviously a um, C shell type design they are extremely soft oh i really want to rub it against my face but you know makeup i'll just put it on but i will surely use them later to take my makeup off so oh i love those they're really really soft and thick as well so hopefully they wash well so yeah second thing cute little bag as well Good for chucking in the washing machine. Next thing, we have a cushion cover and it's probably the wrong way around. Let me see. Nope, you're right. So it has the same design on the front and back. Really love the colours. I love pastel colours. Not a clue where it, what it's from. Should I? No. Is it? Okay, we'll go underneath the sea. I feel like it's, do we have a um, thing in this box? I think it does. I'll find out at the end, but it might be The Girl That Fell Beneath the Sea because it, it feels like I should know it and I have read that book. So, beautiful. Love it. Once I get to the leaflet -y thing, I think it might be at the bottom. I will let you know where they're all from. Next one, again nautical themed, it's The Adventures of, oh I have this book, so this is going to be a plate, the struggle is real, ooh that's pretty. So, this is what the plate looks like. Sorry for the glare. Here we go. Very beautiful. And it's microwave and dishwasher safe. 
just in case you was wondering. <laughs> but yeah, really cute plate. I like that. The plate is inspired by this book by Shannon Shakaborty and really love the plate. And I think, please tell me there's a... Aha, there is. Oh, oh, okay. Other things. I'm excited. So, the next thing I am going to do is the book. I shall be. Oh, I like the happy reading on the drawstring bag. I miss the drawstring bags um, when it comes to Illumicrate. They used to have drawstring bags for their books, but at the minute it's been um, bubble wrap, not liking that very much. So really happy to get I have my first fairy loot one. Oh, there's there's pathos, hold on. Oh, oh, okay. Oh wow. Right, okay, I need to stop teasing. And the book is Sing Me to Sleep by Gabby Burton. Very, very beautiful cover. I love the foiling. Oh. And the sprayed edges are beautiful. I love that. So it copies the design that's on the book. Love a good gold foiling. <laughs> oh, I like this book. I like this book. So the end pages. This is the front. Is the back the same? No, it's not. This is the back. And then the naked hardback. Oh, Sing Me to Sleep by Gabby Burton and then it's got the detailing on the side and then it's got the gorgeous moon on the back. I love the moon. So yeah that is absolutely stunning. Absolutely love this book. Thank you so much Fairy Loot for that. I did pay for this with my own money by the way just to clarify um, but I always like it when they make effort with their books that's in there so let me find out what this is about a duty to protect a desire to kill an impossible love as the last siren in her kingdom she can sing any man to an early grave but her very existence is illegal and if her true identity were ever discovered it would be her life on the line Ooh. featuring an all black and brown cast a forbidden romance and a compulsively dark plot full of twists the seductive YA fantasy is perfect for fans of The Cruel Prince and To Kill a Kingdom. Sounds good, sounds good. Words sting, songs kill. So, and then also in the bag, when I was struggling to get it out, there is a bookmark to match the book. And then it just says June 2023. From the depths obviously the theme of the month and then it's got the fairy loot logo then also we have this gorgeous um artwork to go with the book and it does have a letter from the author on the back also love that so it's got a little interview with the author inside the booklet and then it says next month's theme is cruel intentions so we can look forward to that together so that is the book and all of its goodies that come with it. I'll put that to one side a second because there is still some little bits in the box. Getting the boot to pull out. So we have ah, we have the card for the month, which is very, very pretty. And this is just to tell you about like the ceramic plate. I told you it's um inspired by the adventures of Mana Al Rufi by S.A. Chakaporti. The tea strainer was designed by Blanca Design and that was inspired by The Daughter of the Pirate King. Um, collectible mythology bookmarks, we'll get into those. Um, cushion cover is The Girl Who Fell Beneath the Sea, yes, by Axio. If you haven't read that book, it is very good. I really enjoyed it. Um, and then the extra fix we got is some mythology bookmarks 
it says collectible number 11 which is this one this is ocean absolutely love these and then we have poseidon currently reading a book about that teaches him so and then we have two tarot cards we have Ninth of Stars and Ten of Stars are the two tarot cards this month. I see when I when I watch people's unboxings of these, um, I haven't watched many because you know FOMO, but when I do, um, I always love the tarot cards and the bookmarks from Fairy Loot. So now I have my own. <laughs> The little things in life it is the little things so yeah that is everything i am so excited i really really enjoyed this box i am going to get much use out of everything not sure where i'm going to put the cushion cover just yet maybe in my library we shall see we shall see i'm going to get a lot of use out of the tea strainer and the removal pads because as well as use them to take off my makeup i also use them for like my face care routine when i'm putting toner on and stuff so gonna get a lot of use out of those um really love the plate really love the um pillowcase and the book sounds really really fun and i absolutely adore the bookmarks and everything that comes with it so yeah that is everything that is june's fairy loot box so i shall be unboxing fairy loot from now on and I get to be excited about two boxes, well, three, including the locked library, so. So if you do get Fairy Loot, let me know what you think of this month's box. Um, if you are excited about the book, if you've heard, heard of it previously before on me unboxing this video, because I am yet, I've not heard of it, so. I'm excited to receive, which I'm always glad about because normally if I've heard a book and it's and it piques my interest, I would have pre-ordered it. So I'm glad that I haven't heard of this one and so I've got a new one for my shelves to add. And yeah, let me know what your favourite thing of the of the box is, like item wise. But I, I can't pick a favourite. I'm I'm gonna say either the Probably the tea strainer. Or the makeup. Or the plate. Oh. Well, I'll be using the tea strainer and then putting my biscuits on the plate. Does that count as one? And then those two. <laughs> one. They're my favourites. Hope you enjoyed this video. Please, if you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you would like to see more from me, please subscribe. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye. They, have, they all have the same design. One second. <laughs> I will surely use them later to take the top. I don't want to stand up because then you can see my bit on my bottom. Don't judge me, I'm in pyjama bottoms. <laughs> Success! Guess who's back? And the, the, the sprayed edges. Oh, her true identity will be. Were... At the, <laughs> I'm too excited. As the last siren in her kingdom, she sang any no she can she can it's got a what is this get the skin uh, sleep oh so it's got a little um oh um, what's the word i'm no nah. god i'm dropping everything and it says collectible number 11, a collectible, elect, collect, oh, oh, the pads, makeup pads, removal pads, reusable face pads, whatever.
is with the letter from the author and then the author uh, author author oh these are so pretty i don't want to change out my bookmark i'm using in a minute poseidon you are going in i need to display these somewhere Tarot cards. Tarot cards. I mean, they fit in with my aesthetic, don't they? Tarot cards, tarot cards. See, I don't even want to get rid of the spoiler card because it's so pretty. I mean, she was gorgeous. But you need don't bark, please, darling. on my shelf I'm going to keep what is there little author interview in here somewhere or maybe photo album definitely keeping the bookmark inside I need to stop talking to myself oh it's got a map enemy territory I didn't even check if it was signed I mean we've got a signed letter so don't really need oh it is signed Oh crap. Oh shit, I'm filming. <laughs> oh dear, I don't even know how long it's got. Oh. Well, while I'm filming, I might as well. Um, I've just found. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Oh, you're going to see me talking to myself. So inside the book, it is signed by the author and then also it does have a map love a book with a map in I really don't know how much you just heard <laughs> I need to watch that back that is embarrassing because yes I talk to myself all the time right I need to put the bookmark in so it stays safe open up Right, so the bookmark can stay inside. What I might do with these, so what I might do with these, while, while you're still here, <laughs> with the letter from the author and the author's interview, I do, what I do with, what I do with my witch casket, um, like information cards and little bits that, I think like a really pretty designs I do put them in here so what I might do is go to the back and put the fairy loot ones starting from the back like so so at least I know like what month it came and, and so on and so forth so yeah that's what I'm going to do with them I was so happy you're here to hear me say that oh I'm actually going to save also because I just think it's too pretty to turn away I might put that in front of the fairy loop fairy scoop thing so then it's got the card of what I got in the bum in the box also because that artwork sorry about the glare is gorgeous so that's what I'm going to do with them 
just in case you was wondering. Not like you would be wondering, but. Well, I don't know. You've had me ranting to myself. Overexcited. In my pyjama bottoms, searching out books. Who says I wasn't professional? Now stop filming.